going to say some? Why are you waggling your finger at me, Sonic? What do you think you know that I don't, huh? Lots. Oh, that's fair. Hey, I'm Dr. Dropkick. And I'm the Jive Turkey. And, uh, we're doing Sonic the Hedgehog 1. Yes. I figure it's been a long time since we, we looked at the Genesis. It's been a long time since, well, last time we looked at the Genesis was, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Tech, kind of. Kind of. Technically, that was on the PlayStation 2. Oh, well, except for the very last video. Really? Yeah. I thought we did the whole thing on PS2. No, no, the, uh, the finale we did on this, because remember you did all that, like, game code-breaking stuff? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Anyways, uh, I'm really excited to do this. Yeah, who doesn't like um, Sonic? Right? Sonic's, Sonic's awesome, you know what? Uh, I love, I love the Sega Genesis. I love the Sonic the Hedgehogs. So here we are. I'm gonna say some... Pause. Stop. Pause. Stop. Pause. Stop. That was weird. Why would you duck, do that? Duck, duck, duck. Duck, 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 duck. All right. That was a weird. Why would you do that? Oh, uh, obsessive compulsive disorder. Oh, That's strange. Whee! Uh, so yeah, this was the first. Uh, this is the obviously the Genesis version, not the Master System version. Yeah, which is the same as the Game Gear version. Yep, and not as good. Uh, yeah, but it's got music by Yuto Koshiro. Wait, really? Yeah. Shit, why are we doing that version? Because I don't have it. Because uh, it's, like, very expensive. Uh, fair, that's a good reason. That's a totally valid reason. Whee! Yeah, so, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 introduced the Spin Dash. Well, no, it, yeah, 2 did, yeah. yes. Yes. This, this involved- <laughs> this introduced Sonic. This introduced- yes. Sorry, my brain immediately started thinking we were playing Sonic 2, even after it- because it looks exactly the same. Even if, like, you know, Green Hill Zone's always the first zone. I've always liked the bonus stages in this one. Oh, with Much the better than the first one, or the second one. Because, like... The, uh, this has its own brand of bullshit, but it's oh, yeah. magical bullshit. I should have gotten two more rings. Whatever. So, I actually have very little experience with this specific uh, Sonic the Hedgehog, like Sonic the Hedgehog 1. I used to play this in my friend's house after school every day. Well, we had, uh, we had a Genesis growing up. Uh, we had uh, an NES the Genesis and N64. Um, so, we skipped the Super Nintendo. But, um... Skipped we... the wrong system, Bob. Uh, eh. You know what? I turned out okay. Um... How would you know if you didn't? <laughs> I'd be cutting people's heads off for money. Uh, and what did we just get back from doing? Oh, shit. Yay! I got the Chaos Yay! Emerald! Yay! Going for a completion run. Anyway, so, like, uh, but by the time we got a Genesis, we got the one that came bundled with Sonic 2. Yeah. So, well, a lot of people did. Yeah, so on Sonic Tuesday. Yes. Hey, everybody, it's Sonic Tuesday. But, uh, so, like, I have a lot of experience with two, three Sonic and Knuckles, but I've never played one. I've only seen gameplay of it. I'm still not playing one. I've only seen gameplay of it. But, shit. <laughs> we, we bought ours, like, just before Sonic Tuesday. Oh, yeah? Look at that dithering. I don't know how it's gonna show up on the stream, but it looks great on my TV. Look, transparencies are hard, okay? Ow. So is not running into that lady. So is only having 30. Oh, that's right. Time counts up in this game. Ow. Oh. These games. Wee, I'm going so fast. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Uh, so we've got the manual here. Uh, and the manual's kind of interesting because it's written in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight languages. But what they've done is they basically condensed each language down to like, the manual when the page is An open. eighth of a page? It's like... Maybe Why like, are you showing the maybe camera? Maybe like 15 inches. Like, it's a pretty big, pretty big, long, thin manual, right? Uh, but yeah, like, each language has been condensed down to the, yeah, like an eighth of that. And it makes it really weird. Uh, but I've got the story. Okay, let's hear it. Wanna hear the story? Let's hear it, hotshot tough guy. Crush Dr. Robotnik. Dr. I- Yo, look, look, look at my rings. Oh! oh. <laughs> Dr. Ivo Robotnik, the mad scientist, is snatching innocent animals and turning them into evil robots. Only one tough dude oh. can put an end to the demented scientist's fiendish scheme. Scheme? It's, it's Sonic. 
the real cool hedgehog with the spiked haircut and power sneakers that give him super speed. So it's not, Sonic is not fast. That's the reason why I want to read this, because I've heard this bit of lore before. Yeah. But Sonic the Hedgehog is not fast. It's his shoes that give him super speed. Well, yeah, you've seen, well, you've seen the, uh, the item, right? Yeah. Like, I've already gotten the item in this game. Yeah. It gives him, like, ultra speed, but he's still fast without them. Like, this is him without them. Well, yeah, but also, don't forget that, like, Knuckles and Tails are as fast as he is. Yeah. And they have the ability to climb and fly, like, and glide. Like, he can't do anything. Sonic is actually the most useless character on the Sonic universe. Robotnik's faster than both of them. Yeah. Anyways. It's proven in Sonic 2. Uh, help Sonic fight hordes of metal maniacs and do the loop with the supersonic spin attack. Speed down twisting tunnels and swing over dangerous booby traps. And leap across lava pits and dodge burning rocks. And splash through the chilling waters in an underground cavern. Next page. And if you're lucky, you can warp to the secret zone where you can spin around in a floating maze. Your greatest challenge lurks in the secret lab where you come face to face with Dr. Robotnik himself. Spin through space, loop to your dizzy. Save the animals and become the superhero. Be Sonic, be Atomic. So that used to be his, uh, for this game only, that was the uh, catchphrase. Be Sonic, that's, be Atomic. That's kind of funny. I, I don't remember that. Oh, yeah. Well, you ready for, uh, probably my favorite Robotnik theme? Yeah, go for it. Just love how dramatic it is. Yeah, not as good as, uh, two, but I will give it that this one is, is still really good. There he is, Dr. Ivo Robotnik, now relegated to Dr. Eggman. Yeah. yeah. Which I'm not a fan of his name. I like Dr. Robotnik. Yeah, that's like Sega Japan's thing. Yeah. They're like, uh, they like puns. Yeah. They came up with Miles Prower. Yeah. And then North America came up with Tails. Miles Prower's a brilliant pun of a name. All right, so that's the end of Green Hill. All right, you passed Act 3. Well done, sir. That only took you seven minutes. This is probably my favorite zone. Yeah. It's actually one of my favorite Sonic songs in general. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, Chemical Plant is my favorite. Yeah, I know it yeah. is. I will sing that song, like, all day, Stephanie. You'll be like, Chris, sing me a song. And I'll be like, do 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 and then he'll Sing stab me a you. song of swords and ah, uh, damn it! Ah. Swords and souls. Uh, sing me a song of the piano man. God, this level takes me so back. Yeah, tell me about it. I just remember when this first came out. Like when I first saw it, I was obsessed with this game. It and looks it good. I played these first two zones so many times. I remember playing it at like at my friends' houses. Well, this came out in what 94, right? No, 91. 91. Yeah, so like 1991. This was before the Super Nintendo existed. Well, yeah. And yeah, like yeah. this looks great. All right. What do you suppose that picture is in the background is? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Fuck I, you. I don't care. <laughs> Alright, that's fair. I'm I'm trying to jump. <laughs> I'm jumping here! I'm whooping here. Well, I remember a secret. Oh yeah. Ooh. Oh shit. That is a good secret. Oh, I didn't play the song again. Yeah, I was hoping it would. I was hoping it would break again and make that horrible cacophony. <laughs> I forget what happened there. It was, it basically like tried to play two different sound effects at the exact same time. Well, that was on the PlayStation version, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, why'd I do that? I don't know. It's that Ninja Gaiden thing kicking in. Yeah. Ninja Gaiden 2. Yeah, we like literally just stopped yeah. playing Ninja Gaiden 2, so like. So, we've played Super Metroid today, we've played Ninja Gaiden 2 today, and we're playing this. Yeah. How does it feel? Um, it's an easy transition for me. Yeah? Like, I've, it's not like... Ooh, that was weird. Yeah. <laughs> the Zelda 2 
Mega Man transition was really weird because like I never play those uh, at fair. the same time. Usually when I finish playing a Zelda game, I'm like not playing another game for a while. Yeah. yeah. Screen shake. Oh, I didn't realize, but like the area of the screen that isn't supposed to show is all blue. Oh. Huh. So that's what that blue strip down the side of your screen is. Folks. Yeah. Well, we should probably crop that out. Yeah, I can do that. We can crop it out and put our own logo in instead. Yeah. Well, it'll be 4x3 anyways, so our own logo will be there. Yeah. I can just crop that out. So, folks, the blue bit of the screen that you're not seeing, it's not very big. It's like a couple pixels. Well, no, it's... Oh, you're not seeing it on the capture like I am. I'm not seeing the... Oh, yeah, that's true. Uh, you see the capture? Oh wow! Okay, yeah, I'll, I will zoom. I will decrop for for a minute. So there's a big see. ugly blue box like around around everything. everything. I'll zoom out. So I'll zoom out so you can see it now. Wow, that was ugly. Look at that, right? Isn't that so hideous? God. Well, all you got to do is uncrop. Oh, that reminds you me of your ex girlfriend. Wow, oh, it's alright. You're better off. Than <laughs> all right. Uh, so I'm going to start. This project where I want to start like converting modern movies to VHS. Uh, so Seth and I were talking very briefly, but I guess I would need some kind of like HDMI to like RCA adapter. Well, converting DVDs to VHS is kind of pointless. No, no. Like, well, I would only have them digitally. Why is converting V? I like D. I like VHS. Well, because the whole point with VHS is it's an analog format, right? So, you still have... You're basically just getting a shitty digital uh, image. Yeah. But I also like the idea of like getting to build my own like cases for them. Just draw little doodles on the case of actual. No, yeah, it's not the same. Yeah, you're right, it's better. <laughs> you're the worst. You never support me in my ideas. I support your good ideas. I think this is a fun idea. Good. But if I hit him, then why'd I get hit? Oh, you're hubris! I almost tried to wall jump there. <laughs> Is the Metroid Whoa. kicking in? Metroid and the little oh, and Ninja Gaiden. Yeah. I love this part. Yeah, where are your three spirit hedgehogs? Your two spirit hedgehogs following you. I remember playing this game at a price club. Really? Holy back in the crap. day. I remember, because uh, they just have like little demo units set up yeah. in the middle. So I remember playing that and like getting this far and there's like other kids watching me play and shit. Kind of like what's happening right now. Yeah. <laughs> Except IRL. Hey! What? Weird. Why? I'm a little kid. I just like outdated media formats. At least I'm not trying to convert them to Laserdisc. Well, that would at least make sense, because Laserdisc is a digital format. Well, do you know how expensive Laserdisc writers are in blank Laserdiscs? Yes. Oh, really? How expensive? Like, thousands. Yeah, I know. It's the worst. Yeah, I guess demo stations don't really exist anymore, do they, for anything? No. Well, they do I mean, the kind of TVs and stuff. But. Like, you know, EB will have, like, Wii U set up. Oh, yeah, sure. I guess they will, won't they? Yeah. They're doing, uh, they're gonna start doing retro systems soon at EB if they haven't started already. Well, they, they did it, like, uh, in the States. Yeah. But I don't know if they'll ever bring it over here because it didn't work out too well for them in the States. Yeah, because they overpriced everything. No, that's not the problem. No, that's what I heard. The, Maybe. the main problem was that they were, um, they weren't doing any checks on them. Uh, so people were sending in, uh, retro, or, um, repo carts and, like, straight up bootlegs. Uh, Some people sent them shit with, like, snip terminals. Huh. And they still, all, like, gave them away for full price. Jeez. And then they also tried to sell them for full price. Oh. So they, it was just, like, a mess. That sounds super shitty. Yeah. And then, when shit went bad, they started destroying everything that they collected. <laughs> as they do. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm not really... 
down with that. No. Um, I was talking to a friend of mine who used to work for uh, EB Games. They don't anymore, they quit. But there was some fiasco that they had to do where they they had to open up, like, new games and take, like, promo cards out? Promo codes for something out? And then, like, reseal them with, like, new, um, trick wrap? And that became, like, a huge fiasco. I'm trying to remember what game it was now, but there was some promo code that was like, oh, EB doesn't want this promo code. So they had to take them out. Huh. It's like, that's, that's dumb. That's really... So, if anybody can remember what that game is, I'll have to look it up again. Uh, hit us up in the comments, because that was a, that became like a huge problem. Uh, they got they got called out for it. Right. Feel sick yet? A little bit. I like the uh, the birds in the background. Yeah, I love the background for these stages. Yeah. Let's get the chaos emerald. I'm working on it. Oh, I missed. Oh, Shit. No. Well, now we won't ever get all the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, the thing is, I never know when you can jump, so I basically just mash jump the whole uh, time fair. when I'm in those stages. Fair enough. The important thing is I gotta continue, which is something that we didn't get in Sonic 2. It's true. We got one Chaos Emerald, which you could probably sell for a decent amount. Yeah, not in this economy. Uh, it's like special edition comics from the 80s. Geez, it's yeah. not special if everyone has it. It's true. We need Silver Age Chaos Emeralds. Wolf. I always love that effect. Wolf. Actually, I don't know if this is my favorite level or the one after this is. Because the one after this is a pretty sick level. And then comes easily the worst level. And then I don't remember the rest of the game. <laughs> I remember the fire level being kind of neat. Like There's not, a fire level like in this game? Like the mountain level, I think it was. Wasn't that Sonic 2? Maybe, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing that thing again that I do. You mean like, you're talking about like Spring Yard, right? Yeah. Hello, hello Sonic. It was this big. So do you think Sonic was a cool mascot? Like, not not by 2017 standards. but like Yeah, Sonic was a great like, mascot. Yeah. Who's arguing that? Hardcore Nintendo fans? Even... I'm a hardcore Nintendo fan. Fair enough. Uh, I remember there was a really good Star Trek game. Uh, on the Genesis. Maybe it was on the SNES, too. I love that uh, Deep Space Nine uh, game on Super Nintendo where, like... Cisco is just like running full tilt around the ship. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Uh. My brother showed me that a long time ago. That's I think awesome. I've shown it to you. I don't think I've seen it. No, I've definitely shown it to you. I showed it to you around the time we started this channel. Oh, okay, so that's probably why it's, it's all lost in the mists of my memory now. My old man memory. Gotta get some more level 3 cash. Yeah, right? Use a bit more RAM while we're in there if you don't mind. Some good platforming in this. Yeah. yeah, I saw some gameplay of that like Sonic 4, the digital one that they put out yeah, recently. Yeah, the one that that's on uh, like smartphones and shit. Yeah, man, the platforming in that looked really rough. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what else to say about that, but like that the platform just seemed not fun. You didn't really get a chance to go fast. Uh, it doesn't... You know. This game was more about platforming than going fast. Oh, yeah. It just got sold on the going fast. Yeah. Especially in number two. Number two is all about going fast. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Took that fireball right up your hedgehog ass. What if I go back if I can find one ring? Whoa, I saw that twitch. There we go. I always love how Sonic has trouble like starting momentum on hills. Yeah. With the Sonic physics.
No, don't, don't do it. Get out of there. Don't get greedy. Yeah, that good, good call. Be safe. I just gotta get in sync. There you go. Nice, high five. Remember the uh, the two Sonic cartoons? Yeah, yeah, I used to like those. Yeah. Hang on, we can't talk about that yet. Why not? No. Oh. Yeah. Whatever. We can talk about what we want when we want. I'm a goddamn adult. See you next episode.